I feel very good to be back with you again in this neuro management video presentation. We have been talking about the targets of neuromarketing. Now the target of the neuromarketing approach is the reptilian brain and the paleomammalian brain. These two primitive portions of our brain is the, are the targets of the neuromarketing approach. Now I will share with you a live case study. The doorbell rings and the homemaker lady, she opens the door and there is a door-to-door -door salesperson standing there and he suddenly exclaims, so what a beautiful house you have, madam. I am Amit from Eureka Forbes. May I come in? Now the lady's status need is already fulfilled when the young man appreciates the beautiful house. He comes in. Oh, what a lobby! Compared to your house, today's apartments are like cages where animals live and birds stay. So, I like this house. Her status need is further fulfilled. Where are you from, young man? I'm Amit from Eureka Forbes. Now Eureka Forbes rings a bell. Her familiarity need is satisfied. But can they offer something new? I know about their products. He, she feels, she thinks. We have something new to offer to you. So novelty. So the need for familiarity and novelty are both fulfilled. These are the needs of the reptilian brain. If you remember my earlier presentations, the reptilian brain, the reptiles, they are having their familiar prey. But when the prey is familiar but has a novelty, some new color or some new shade, hmm, some contrast, it attracts the reptile. Now she is prepared to listen. Madam, uh, can I give a demo? Yes. Where are the AC mains? He asks. And then he gives the demo. The lady is happy with the salesman's personality, his behavior. So her relatedness, the relationship need, which is also a part of the reptilian brain and the paleomammalian brain's needs is fulfilled. Now we have a warranty for this product, one year warranty. So the certainty need is also fulfilled. Certainty is a need of the paleomammalian brain. We want to be certain about what we are going to get. We should not be cheated. Now there are several colors available so you can go for any shade. I have got a different shades here. So her autonomy need is fulfilled. She is allowed to take an independent decision. Now, she likes the young man, so the related need, relatedness need, the relationship best need is also fulfilled. Now these are all needs of the paleomammalian brain. Now uh, we have for very selected customers a special offer the monthly installment scheme so that it will not be a burden on you madam so I am offering you the monthly installment scheme so the young man is very fair so the fairness need is also fulfilled so we have a beautiful model now the scarf model S for status C for certainty A for autonomy R for relatedness and a for fairness. The scarf model is related to the reptilian brain and the paleomammalian brain. So this is a beautiful case study. It is a live example. Now we had conducted a few workshops for salespeople of Eureka Popes after two of their very senior territory managers attended a workshop by us conducted in the Park Hotel, Calcutta. So in the next episode also, we'll give you a live case study. Thank you very much. We'll see you again.